Oh man, the dinner table is set and it looks so beautiful. Uh, Julia, everybody, come and sit at the table and get ready for dinner. Oh man, I'm so ready for dinner. Wow, Chef Pete set up the table really nice. Hey Junior, you want to see a magic trick? Yeah. I'll bet you five bucks that I can pull this tablecloth off the table so fast it won't even move the dishes. I bet you can't. Yes, I can. All I gotta do is say the magic words. Abracadabra. You ready, Junior? Yeah, I'm ready. All right, here we go. All right, I'll go get your five bucks, Junior. What, what was that loud noise? Ah! What happened to my dishes? Junior! Don't blame me. Jeffy bet me five bucks. That five bucks, Junior. Oh, thanks, Jeffy. Jeffy bet me five bucks. They can pull the tablecloth out without moving the plates. Wait, well, move them. They're right there. I, I, they did move. So that's why I won five bucks. You know what, Junior? What? Mario! Mario! What's wrong, Chef Pee Pee? Your son. Hey, Dan, can I talk to you for a second? Hold on, Chef Pee Pee. What's wrong, Jeffy? Now, Chef Pee Pee's about to tell you a whole bunch of lies. Oh, is he? Oh, yeah, and not a single thing's gonna be true. But what I did want to tell you was, I've gone the whole day without saying the F word. Well, I'm really proud of you, Jeffy. Thanks, Daddy. What's wrong, Chef Pee Pee? Your son broke all of the dishes in the kitchen! He did what? Debatable. What? Actually, what happened was, I was doing a magic trick, and I pulled the tablecloth really fast, and the dishes hit the floor. So technically, the floor broke the dishes. Chevy, why would you pull the tablecloth and break all the dishes? Because it was a magic trick, Daddy! I want to be a magician, okay? Fine, I'll admit it. I'm an amateur magician. Is that what you wanted me to say? Wow, Daddy, you're a really good parent. You're supposed to be encouraging my hopes and dreams. But no, I guess I'll just give up and go be a garbage man or something. Yeah, go be a garbage man and clean up the mess you just made in the kitchen. Well, there wouldn't be a mess in the kitchen if Chef Pee Pee would buy plastic plates for me to practice with. Or even better, he should buy paper plates, because then he could just use them and then throw them away, and he wouldn't even have to worry about dishes. Mario, just come and look at the mess. I'm going to look at the mess. Hey, Daddy, I'll bet you five bucks there's not a mess in the kitchen. Okay, I'll bet you five bucks. Well, hold on. You got to give me a 30-minute head start to go clean it up. No, Jimmy! Alright, well then fine. Be disappointed. Look, Mario! <laughs> I'm a doggy in the streets, but a freak in the sheets. I said, yeah, yeah. Jeffy, I'm so tired of you making messes all the time. You threw off my groove. Jeffy, I don't, my what? No, Jeffy, I'm so tired of you making messes and doing bad things. Just stop. Well, Danny, I have a wild imagination, and I'm just being creative. Jeffy, breaking stuff and doing bad things is not being creative. Well, I'm a young spirit, and I need to frolic. <laughs> oh, I just wish there was something I could do to you to punish you so you'd learn something. Um, well, you could give me a spanking. I'm not giving you a spanking, Jeffy, because every time I give you a spanking, you go, Oh, she poppy! You don't even, it doesn't even hurt you. Well, I promise I won't go, Oh, she poppy, okay? Here, give me a spanking. Like a good hard one. Like, put a little bit of hate behind it. <sighs> oh! She poppy! See, see, that's why I don't give you spankings, Jeffy. I, I wish there was another way to punish you where you'd learn something. <laughs> no, poopy butt. No, I said do not go on the couch. Where's your shot color remote? <laughs> Wait a minute. Shot, hmm. shot collar? Hmm. Daddy, I have an idea. What? Why don't we put the shot collar on you, and every time you yell, it'll shock you. I got a better idea. Daddy, this is not what I had in mind. All right, Jeffy. Now, every time you do something bad, I'm going to shock you. Does it hurt? Do you want to find out? Kind of. Then do something bad. Ah! Just kidding, Daddy. It doesn't work. Ah! I was hoping you would believe me. All right, Jeffy, every time you do something bad, I'm going to shock you. Okay, well, I just won't do anything bad. <laughs> yeah, like I believe that. I bet you can't go 24 hours without doing something bad. You know what? If you can go a whole day without doing something bad, you can take it off. Okay, and now I'll put it on you, and I'll shock you every time you do something bad. Okay, that's a deal. So how about this? From 6 p.m. today till 6 p.m. tomorrow, you can't do anything bad. All right, deal. 24 hours without doing anything bad just so I can shock you one time? That's a deal, Daddy. Easy peasy. Well, you're going to lose the bet because you're going to do something bad. No, I won't. All right, well, I think it's dinner time, Jeffy. Oh, good. I'm hungry. What's for dinner? Come on. All right, Jeffy. Look what's for dinner. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, daddy, you rascal. So you're gonna eat them, Jeffy, or are you gonna throw your plate on the ground like you always do? Well, as much as I would like to add to the collection of broken plates on the floor, I so badly want to shock you. So I'm gonna eat every single one of these disgusting green boogers with a huge smile on my face. I would love to see that. All right, daddy, watch me work. Oh man, Dave, those were some disgusting green beans, but it's gonna be worth it when I can hold down that button and shock you until your eyes pop out of your head. That's gonna be pee pee. I can't believe you just ate those, Jeffy, but you're gonna mess up soon. You're gonna mess up eventually. No, I won't, Daddy, because it's gonna be worth it. Well, well, you still have to go to school tomorrow, and you better be there on time, and you better not get in trouble at school. Okay, Daddy, I'm actually gonna wake up early, and I'll even walk to school. The shock collar is such a good idea, but I don't want him to shock me. I have to get him to mess up. All right, Jeffy, you have to go to bed. And if you pee the bed, that counts as doing something bad. Danny, don't worry. I have a clothes pin and I closed the hole off. So I'm not peeing the bed tonight. Well, if you, if you still have an accident, that counts as doing something bad, and then you won't be able to shock me tomorrow. Daddy, rest assured, you will be shocked tomorrow night. Well, no, no, you're going to mess up. I, I know you are. You pee the bed almost every night. Nope. So, uh, good night, Jeffy. Good night, Daddy. All right, so all I have to do now is fill up a glass of water and pour it on Jeffy's bed and make him look like he had an accident. And then he can't shock me tomorrow. All right, all I have to do is pour the water on the bed and make it like Jeffy peed so he can't shock me tomorrow. You what? piece of shrimp! What? Daddy, what are you doing? Uh, I, I want to start a garden in your room, and I wanted to grow strawberries. Oh, really? Well, let me tell you what I think happened. I think you were pouring the water in your bed to make it look like I peed the bed so I could get in trouble, and you would shock me! Uh, 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 no. Let me tell you something, Daddy. I'm not going down that easy. So you hot bottom out of this room, and you go to bed. Uh, yes, sir. Yeah, that's what I thought, mister. Stupid dang trying to get me in trouble. I'm not going to sleep all night long. Oh, all right, Crafts. Today, we're going to have a quiet day because I have a huge headache. I'm talking big. Not like my egg roll, but big, you know. So today, you guys are going to be quiet, okay? I don't care what you do. You can draw. You can color. You could take a nap. I, I don't care. You could literally go home, okay? I literally don't care. Just as long as you guys be quiet, okay? And I'm going to take a nap on my desk. And you guys better not wake me up. Because if you do, I'm going to give you guys a lot of homework. I'm talking a hundred pages of homework, a hundred pages of schoolwork, and you can't go home until you finish it all. So leave me alone. Oh. Wait, so we can't even whisper? Dude, shut up. I don't want any homework. But you're the one getting louder. You, dude, you're the one talking. I was just asking a question. Yeah, shut up, God. Shut up. Do you think I can eat my fish and chips in class? No, Harry, you're making a lot of noise. You're gonna get homework. Why would you want to eat in class? Well, wait, wait, he just wants to get homework because he's a nerd. Oh, big nerd. Another one? A nerd. Oh, I hate wearing this stupid collar. <laughs> you're wearing a dog collar? I didn't know you were a dog. I'm a doggy in the streets, but a freak in the sheet to say, yeah, yeah. Dude, yeah. shut up. I don't want any homework. Well, stop talking to me. Oh, man. The TV remote is dead in my room. I guess I'll just watch it in here. Where's that remote? Ah, <laughs> there it is. Eh. Oh, I think I'm just going to go ahead and take a nap. <laughs> Did I hear a noise? Huh? Was it any of you who made a noise? Huh? Huh? Just must have been a bad dream that I had. But anyway, if you make a noise, then you're gonna think you're in a bad dream from all the homework you're gonna get. So, shut up! Jeffy, why'd you make a noise? Do you want us to get homework? Yeah, Jeffy, shut up! Yeah, Jeffy, be quiet! Oh, shut up, doggy. I swear if you make us have homework, I'm gonna punch you in the face! Oh, why is my daddy shocking me? Oh, oh, maybe his fat butt sitting on the remote. I really don't want homework. Oh, I got an idea. What if I just hide in my new backpack I got from smlmerch.com, link in the description, comes in two separate designs and also has a lunchbox. Maybe that'll muffle the sound. Why isn't it working? Ugh. Shut up, grass.
Jeffy, just go home. Just leave. You're making too much noise. I don't want homework. Yeah, dude, leave. Yeah, leave. Yeah, dude, just get out of here. Oh, I'm leaving. <laughs> that is it, Press. I said no noise. And now you all are going to get a bunch of freaking homework. Way to go, Jeffy. Now we have a bunch of homework. Oh, yeah, dude, you're a loser. Boo! Oh man, my stomach was hurting. Daddy, I got in trouble at school today. You did? Yes, yes. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. You, you said you were gonna shock me. You said you were gonna shock me. Oh, well, shock this. Oh, shock some of this. Oh, what happened to? I'm gonna be a good boy. What happened to? I'm not gonna get in trouble. You know what? Oh, shock this. Oh. Daddy, I was sitting in class and all of a sudden you shocked me to make me scream during class, so I got in trouble. What? No, no, I didn't. I swear I didn't. I haven't even touch this. Okay, well then maybe your fat butt sat on it and you didn't even know because you were too busy watching TV, you fatty. What? No, I was in the bathroom the whole time. You were in the bathroom the whole time I was at school for eight hours, you constipated fatty? What? No, Jeffy, look, I did not touch this. You just got in trouble because you can't help yourself and since you got in trouble in school, I'm going to shock you. Ah! Daddy, you know what? <laughs> Oh, oh, you, you want to sit there and shock me? I got something for you. I'm shock this. All right, let's see how you like it. Winky, winky, eggs and bacon. <laughs> Jeffy, take this thing off me. No, Daddy, you tried shocking me today while I was at school, so I would get in trouble and lose the bet. Well, no, I didn't. Jeffy. <laughs> Jeffy, take it off me now. No, Daddy, and let's also remember when I was trying to go to bed and you tried pouring water in the bed to make me look like I peed to bed and I would get in trouble. Oh, no, I was watching the garden. <laughs> yeah, garden this, daddy. <laughs> oh, and also, let's remind ourselves of dinner last night where you made me eat green beans. So now I'm going to shock you for every green bean that I had to oh, eat. Jeffy, no, no, you ready? <laughs>